Here we here we have a field of man 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 tree plants, man trees. And in between, you can see the uh, the grey grey or graying nature of the uh, quartz silty quartzite soil between the patches here. And you find some uh, basal rosettes of various uh, forms of auricular peltata growing in amongst them. But oh, here we go. These are the so-called basal rosettes of now what's called Drosa hookerii. Of course, it has two eyes at the end because it's named after a person, and it ends with a con that ends with a consonant. So it's hookerii with two eyes, just like Bermanii, Hamiltonii, and other exem exemplars like that. But uh, now, if this was to go greyer, as it does in other parts of Australia and the world, you'll get a, a wider range of carnivorous plants. That's only because you know why it's going grey, of course. The big, the one key factor that we've all missed over the years about carnivorous plants, why they're special, why they're out, why they're on the side of basically other plants. So, yes. And here we have a, a crop of Baumia. That has a lovely glaucus. Uh, look to it and it can even go sort of brownie too uh, at the end of the dry as we go into autumn back into the wet sort of thing it can be in a almost purpley brown looking state it's very interesting anyway that's me over and out for a while I think need to go down to Mount Compass soon and make some uh, little movies down there I think